with it. Don't put too much detail in there. Use specific words. Although you might have a lot of background knowledge about this specific scene, try to just pull from that specific excerpt. All right, so make that a That is a file. Yes. Okay. And Bradley, what was the specific line that you were focusing on when I was over there you were talking about? Um, we were talking about like outside of the room the walls. It was kind of like hell itself. Right. So Romeo's saying, I can't live outside Verona's walls. Now why? Anybody can answer this. What is outside Verona's walls? Yeah, Caleb. Some other Italian city state. Very good. Some other Italian city state. <laughs> and who is not there? Juliet. Juliet. Which, as we see, is the center of his love now. Now that he's met her in the balcony scene, he's totally forgotten about Roseline and all of his decisions, whether they're passionate or reasonable, are focused on this one girl, on Juliet's metaphors there. Awesome. So now let's think. What themes felt from these later scenes? Makes sense. Um, yeah. um one for family. Yeah. Family is worth killing over. Ooh, deep. Family oh. is worth <laughs> killing <laughs> over. And here, I like that that kind of leads off the first theme that we created here. Family doesn't have to be blood related. And you guys have kind of read, and we, um, one specific scene where Romeo meets Tybalt, it was your scene. So family is worth killing over. And why did Romeo kill Tybalt? Who is Tybalt? Sarah. Tybalt is like, I think he was Awesome, yes. And he killed him because, well Tybalt like came like in the town or something, he was trying to start something with Romeo, but he didn't, Romeo didn't want to like fight him, so his friend, Barcuccio, yeah. yeah. He like decided to fight Tybalt instead and then, Tibble killed his friend. Awesome. That was a great summary of